So I've come to realize, you know, being someone who's actually, like, okay, you know, like, semi-known on YouTube, <clears throat> um, is that you get a lot of questions fast. I posted that heel flip video, um, and I think the other high def video test with the cube, and I, I man, my inbox, let me see here, how much did I get? Ooh, I, I just successfully posted an old, um, I mean the 3x3x5 video that I made with this camera here. This is the camera that I've been using, uh, the questions that I've been actually getting, let me get to them. Um, actually, I really don't want to single anyone out. I have like about a page worth of questions. Um, is what cameras do I use? Um, the camera I'm using now is actually the Sony Zac D. Um, let me let me uh, film it for you. It's the Sony. This, I mean, uh, it's a Sanyo, not Sony. It's the Sanyo Zac D CG10. As you can see here, see me in the. Hey guys, it's going. Um, this is this little guy right here. It's actually uh, it's, it's pretty cool. I think it films in 720p or I think 1080p. I can't remember. All I do is I output it as a uh, 1080p. And it works really well. Um, so that's the first high definition camera that I got. But then I realized battery life is pretty decent. It's about um, 90 minutes, um, maybe a little more. And then the memory card issue, which is I only had 8 gigs. And when I, I like to store my files and videos that I've made on the camera until I decide to export it onto an external hard drive, which I really don't have much time to do. Um, but anyway. So it, it kind of gets cluttered and filled, and then I have to, you know, go through and delete stuff. So I, I, as much as good as this camera is, which I really like, um, it just kind of became not so much a hassle, but just kind of like time-consuming to do the editing and stuff like that. So w that's what led me to buy this camera, which is the camera that I'm using in those recently those recent videos that everyone's been asking about. You know, they ask what camera did you use, how did you do the slow mo, blah blah, blah all this stuff. Um, well, not blah blah blah, but you know what I mean, all this stuff. Anyway, so. Um, the one thing I wanted to show you is the camera that I'm using now is actually this right here. Ooh, the ISO is a little bad, but, um, got a little noise. But it is the Sony CX500. It's a 12 megapixel, um, still image resolution and whatnot. I think it records at that, that too. It has Exumer R, um, uh, sensor that's what gives it really good low light and it's a uh, touch screen and everything and it's just it's just really awesome you know so that's what I've been using to make my videos and someone asked me um, how I made my super my slow-mo look so good it's because if you go in here and you go into your um, camera settings let me find it you got a thing called smooth slow record mode it records six seconds at a time but I think it records at 600 frames a second or something like that or more I can't remember all I know is that it's really awesome that's what, that's what it's, um, it looks like and then you just you know like say I was to do this I'll throw a pillow over there and we'll capture that right there perfect and then it'll uh, it'll play back for you in slow-mo there's a pillow coming in you know what I'm saying? So, that's uh, how I got the super slow-mo. But, um, one of the main things I've been, uh... I've been uh, telling myself is, you know, at first I was like, man, it's kind of tough, you know, being known on YouTube, you have to make all your videos, make them somewhat on time, you know, satisfy the viewers. And I have been doing that a lot lately. And it kind of gets stressful sometimes, especially when I'm trying to make my videos for the 5 awesome keepers and I don't get it on time. Which, actually we have something going on with that channel, so stay tuned. Don't, you know, give up on that channel just yet. Or at all, if you can. Anyway, um... But then I came to realize that, you know, it's actually really cool, and you know, being pretty known. Because I just see, just now I have like, like three or four more messages. Let me click on two of them. Uh, when do you think they'll be available? Blah blah blah. Well, not blah blah blah, but you know. Um, tie-in question. Here, I'll show you. You know, here's something about the new camera. Co the new camera question they're asking about. Um, if so, he's got a beautiful ollie. You know, just more stuff. Well, I didn't know my screen 
video did the video like that, or maybe it's just the recording on the Sanyo. But anyway, um, yeah, see, I, I get messages a lot, so don't think I don't read them. I read every single one of them. So it's actually I came to realize it's pretty cool that people send me a bunch of messages. So if you guys have messages, requests, you know, questions about the video, how I did things on the video, you know, send me, send me, send me the questions. You know, maybe I'll make some videos like this when I have time. Like right now, I have some time, and then um, we'll get it going. I'll make some videos telling you what I uh, what I use and do, like I did just now, and. Um, yeah, so let's get into what uh, software I use now. <laughs> 